YouTube. We're out here in Topsail, North Carolina. And we're gonna try to catch us some fish today. Try to maneuver my way around this ramp. It's kind of foggy this morning. We're coming in at a low tide, going up to a high tide. And uh, dropping stuff. <laughs> So to give you a little bit of history about this beach, well, there's two things. The first thing is, is folklore saying that this island actually got its name because pirate ships used to hide behind the island and they'd go out of the inlet and they would, you know, rob cargo ships. So this place got the infamous name of Topsail Island. It was also a missile testing site back in the mid 1900s, I think. But they did uh, their first guided missile test, so kind of fun fact. I don't know, you probably can't see it in the camera, but there's an actual tower, observation tower, right down there on the shoreline. So, pretty cool. They've definitely built up the beach. I think I just saw a horse fly go around me, so hopefully they stay away today. It's mighty cold for them, so I don't even know what they're doing out here. But man, that's just, it's a beautiful looking, sunrise right here even though it's really cloudy it's kind of cool I like the fogs rolling across the water anyway let's get to fishing let's see what it is a little baby pompano Whew, stabbing me Here we go guys, a little bit small, Woo. salt water in the eyeballs does not feel good. Did he? fish watch out for their teeth yeah. we'll, we'll go ahead and let them go Oop. what it did the break it did the braid not thing another can't see out in the ocean it's just a dense thick fog so I don't know it's just kind of cool looking you don't really get to see the beach like this too too often there we go another little pompano I completely lied to you guys it was nothing decent all right we'll let them go that's cool they got green eyes yeah just caught a puffer fish on the jig too yeah they sound like balloons when you're getting off. He does. They got some tough skin, man. Woo. It sounds like a little. It sounds like a little bouncy ball, honestly. Bro, like, little puffer feet. Go ahead and let him go. Look at all the little spikes everywhere. Boop, deflate. You got it. You can deflate. There he goes. Oh, oh, it's a little whiting. Oh, he's bait. You are bait. Yes. Come here. That's one you want to squeeze really hard by. Yeah, the by the gills. And just loop the hook around. That's all you got to do. There you go. All right, guys. Bite's still a little bit slow. Water temp is kind of cool. 
Still seeing fish jump though, so they're still out here. And we're still catching puffer fish, catching whiting and little baby pompano here and there. Um, just kind of enjoying it. I mean, the water's absolutely beautiful today. I mean, I can't get over how clear it looks out here. This is like some nice Florida looking water almost. <laughs> it's just, uh, the fish ain't here like it's Florida. I'm seeing tiny little fish jumping, guys. Right in front of me. Oh man, they're, they're literally like right in front of me, guys. Maybe I can actually hook up into one now. Oh yeah. They're definitely jumping out here now. I just gotta be careful. Oh, Steven caught another whiting, guys. Oops. Oh, man. Come on, Spanish. Soak my reel. Come on. Whoa. Come on, waves. Don't be doing that now. Man, the fish are definitely jumping out here. This is the spot. As long as the waves don't do nothing crazy, like uh, I think it's about to do. Yep. Here's another one. I'm determined to catch something on this spoon, guys. There we go. We're on. We're on. We're on. Oh yeah. Heck yeah. We're on. We got a Spanish. Heck yeah. Looks like a keeper Spanish. Spanish mackerel. He looks like a keeper too. You want to keep him? Hell yeah. We can cook him. I mean, uh, play him. Yeah. Good thing. Yeah, I saw him bursting out there, and I was like, "Let me cast a spoon." Yes, it is a big fish, Emma. Look at that fish. Yeah. Yep. So he's gonna be food, guys. Awesome. And he's bleeding himself out. Yep. Pretty much bleeding himself out. Go ahead and put him in the ice bucket. Solid. Why'd you stop? Oh, yeah. oh, he broke it off. Yeah. Isn't that fun? Oh my god, dude, you gotta go deep. I know. But when you do, they're just like... <laughs> I thought I was gonna get pulled into the water with that big one. I saw him. Oh my water. god, that's dude, a huge one. That like... That's exhausting. That's just like you have to swim while reeling with the no! wave. Well, at least you hooked into some Spanish, so... You know they're out there. All right, so today was pretty good. We uh, caught a bunch of fish. I landed a Spanish mackerel and Steven caught several. Um, caught some whiting, some pompano, uh, some puffer fish. That's, that's new on the list. Um, still no black drum, but we are landing a variety of species today. The water was like perfect. The bite was a little bit slow, but I had a great time out here at uh, Topsail Island. So until then, I'll see you guys next time. All right, YouTube. I think this uh, about does it out here at Topsail Island. The land of the pirates, island of the pirates. It was uh, a good day. I'm happy. I'm ready to go get some food. I'm worn out. I've been here all morning. <laughs>
So until next time, see you guys later. Thank you.